So Michael was very fast with updating Atmosphere to the version 1.10.0, which will support the original firmware of the Switch up to 21.00. Now what I want to do is to show you how you can update this very very quickly. So if you join here the Telegram group, which I will have a link inside the description, you can just click here on the pinned message to get into the chat here inside and then if you go here to homebrew packs you will find the pack which you can download then. You will get a RAR file out of it. Um, I recommend getting the folder to your desktop and then connect your micro SD card with your computer. I'm doing this right now here over Hecate. Whoops. Now first things first what you should do is to delete the atmosphere folder so that we can just get rid of any complications or problems and then you just want to copy paste everything from here here inside. Now I already did that, uh, I will just copy uh, the atmosphere folder once again because I deleted it. And if it asks you to replace stuff, just click on yes replace, like now. And once that's done, you can actually already eject your microSD card and put it back into your switch. And then what we want to do is to boot into the system. You can either go to the Emunant or the Sysnant. I recommend to update actually both, first the Emunant and then the Sysnant. But I will just show it to you right now over the Emunant. Now once you're here inside, you want to go to the album and you want to go to daybreak you want to install and then you want to search for firmware 21.00 so that you can update your uh, system to 21.0.0 if you didn't do it already and uh, this will happen offline so you won't connect to the internet etc or like not the servers from nintendo etc so click here on preserve settings install fat32 plus xfat and then continue once it's installed you can just click here on reboot now once you're in hecate again you can go to launch again and then launch the nand that you updated let me actually quickly clean it here i think it looks a little bit better better late than never i guess all right and once you're here inside i'm gonna show you first that we are on 21.00 which is here right now, you should see it. Just a quick heads up, a lot of apps right now aren't working on the version 21.00, which means when if I were you, I would wait for one to two weeks until you are actually going to update. This video was mainly for people who um, accidentally updated to 21.00 and want to have full access to custom firmware again, or for people that come after those one to two weeks because then once again are the apps fully uh, updated and start to support version 21.00. And also for my patron supporters, you know that I will actually do also the mega package with everything updated, etc. So, so that you can still use everything that you had before after the update. Alright guys, I hope you liked this video. Don't forget to smile. My name is you. Peace.